What's up guys, here's this Victor, another commentary video on a double evolution tournament is here, so welcome to this commentary video. We have a long way for this real tournament and the all of the part from the win zero until I hope I could reach rank will upload here and I hope in this real tournament I could finish uh, 25 wins because in the last, in the second last tournament I just gonna reach the 23 or 24 wins and I'm gonna fail on the last step. So I will play with this golem, the golem void and the evil bomber and the evil zip is my options. You can't tell me and ask me that. Spectre if you don't have any evil bomber and the evil zip what should we do because it's real tournament and the, all the cards is open for you but with a big distance that you will use a dagger dodges. I think that's going to be my last experience with the dagger dodges on the, on the real tournament because you know that the, the dagger dodges will be nerfed for uh, nerf badly soon. So just I need to check that do we have evil god barrel that no we can't use this evil god barrel and uh, it's better. <laughs> it's better so guys uh, let's start the first match and my goals, uh, let me a bit decrease, my goal is um, reaching in this video 7 wins without lose a step by a step I will pass, so I will play Zap for cycling, Lumberjack is ready, so I play Rocket Dropper and a Hog Rider, oh my internet connection is a bit annoying me, I don't know why but, don't worry we play the Mega Minion here, Okay. So Golem is from the right side. So we play the Witch. The most annoying card is Witch and the Wizard. Really my issue in this real tournament is that how I'm gonna performance against this giant wizard deck. So I will block the void and no bomber please be alive Megane okay we go to armor jack he's normal tower and I will play one zap for just cycling another zap it's a dangerous set guys one of the most um, horrible and dangerous things on the first starting of the real tournament is that at least one opponent find with a really creepy and really weird deck to annoy you so let's see how can I manage this deck uh, about 80% of times I'm unable like all the players so uh, if I could reach 15 wins without lose really it's a good goal for me but I told it really depends to 20 wins until 25 wins that the game matching system how wanna um, give you some match so guys if you didn't like the video please like and subscribe the channel we will have a daily videos with the golem gameplay with the commentaries and uh, it can really help you so I have the evil bomber I have the void I have the zap I have a good option on hand so I think he misses white many times I missed it so um, it will play the uh, mega knight I will play the zap. Okay. So I need three crowns, guys. Don't forget in this early winnings of the real tournament, we need the maximum crown. That's GG will play the first match, three crowns. What is better than this really? This is the ideal start of the royal tournament for me. And I'm so happy that I could finish the first match with winning. So going for the continue of the winning guys, I have to reach league 10 as soon as possible. Uh, last day we didn't have with you, so you have to compensate and uh, thanks for your support. So we have the e -barbs and the mm, Valkyrie and the Mega Minion, oh excuse me, mm, Mega Minion Golem e in the Void. So he played the Valkyrie, so I will play the Mega Minion. Guys, in this range of the mm, trophy, I will uh, try to learn more tips. So I play the Bomber, there is no Golem for the Nihavich. That I want to play the golem, so I will just play one lumberjack for defending and cycling my zap. I will wait and. Oh, oh. Just wait can save me. <gasps> Balloon connected? How it's possible? Three shot from the void and tower connected one times. How? That was a bug or glitch? 
I don't know what. I think that match they told you that one opponent will find to annoy you is this match. Firecracker Inferno. So I will be completely silent. <laughs> Skeleton army. Please kill this cracker, thank you. I get a tower. I survived. I survived and I get a tower. That's a really good tower. Trading? Yes, the tower trading because I lose one of my towers. But I am still insist on my words. It was a glitch. Three shots from the void. Uh, daggers connected, but why the balloon connected? This is my question. So bomber from here because maybe play lumber loom. But I want to um, cycle my oh, 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 oh evil Valkyrie. Evil Valkyrie lonely can defend your golden with a night witch. Daggers finished. Eh. Evil Valkyrie, come on! What is what a match is going to be? What a match, really! What a match! What a good that he played a minion for defending the e -ball. because uh, I wanted to get a 3 crown, thank you. So this match was really weird, a really hard match and I thought that it's one of his opponent that wanna uh, lose one of my losing slots behind 12 and 15 wins and this is the most interesting things of the real tournament in this early part. You may say that we can reach the 5 wins but uh, in this video I'll try to um, transfer more tips and also um, it's really exciting the how to play this creepy decks. Um, three, this is my third match and all of them are using, using the firecracker. What's the equality in the game really? Why firecracker is always? So because he played his evil Valkyrie I will play the barbs in let's see... Oh Pekka. So So I have to play the Mega Minion guys because it will spawn some skeleton. I defend and I'm still behind. My dagger's finished. So hard cut. What happened? What's wrong to me? Skeleton. Better than nothing. Oh, toxic cards. Many toxic cards. Double barrel. Skeleton army. Witch. Pekka. Okay. Confidence is key. Experience is key in these matchups. So he may repeat the evil. He may repeat the barrel. I told you.
That's perfect counter attack. Damn it, you witch. Why the witch is alive? So we'll play Rocket Dropper behind this Pekka. So we may play the Skeleton Army or Witch. That's okay, GG will play. Really, that was too hard counter matchup. I think the game matching system is escaping me and uh, it's gonna annoy me. Uh, I'm going to experience and seeing my worst start in the real tournament on the game matching system. Three wins, but um, this three mats was candidate for losing, really. Head counter. Even their names are <laughs> dangerous. <laughs> okay. Evil Bomber is on hand, so... Valkyrie, wow. All the opponents have Evil Valkyrie and the Racket Dropper. So I play the Zep. Because he may play the Racket Dropper that... He didn't play it. I will play the Void. The Fendress, maybe play the Giant. Evil Wizard with any combination, with any win condition card is dangerous and hard counter for me. So our daggers wasted. I wanted to use my daggers for the balloon. This is the second or third time that I'm going to miss one skeleton. No worry, then the tiebreakers of we are equal, but um, his deck is a bit annoying. No, it's really annoying. Skeleton army got barrel for cheap defending, princess for annoying me, evil wizard for using every Strategy and Balloon. So we play the Golem, guys. I hope you play the Evil Wizard. Thank you. I was more than ready. Okay, so he may play the Valkyrie, guys. So... We'll play the Night Witch, yes. Look at my prediction. So he may play the Skeleton Army or Gob Gang, so Evo's if he's ready. No worry. I get a tower and this is that I have support from three stuns out is that there is no time for EP playing the Gob Gang or Skeleton Army, so that's why did they play the Evo Zap guys there. Oh so we play the e -bars because I don't think so, any Mega Knight should be on the disc deck, maybe the Valkyrie Blade or things, no, Valkyrie, Evil Valkyrie is coming. So we need to defend Evil Valkyrie on his map, so... Okay, GG. Do we play the Golem from here? I will let him to get my second tower if you rush. Okay, this tower is for you, but I will get your second tower. But guys, if he play balloon, what should I do? That he played. Look at the right side. That's GG will play, there is no time for even watching the balloon that it will connect or no. And either it was connect or not, I was the winner. And that was it. This is the tower through the strategy that you will show you are sure that you can get the tower and you will let your opponent for getting your tower. So I am on a four or five wins. I don't know. Good luck. So definitely I will play Zap. Why we I mean why? So I think his hand is open that <laughs> in this minute is going to annoy me with his emotes. Expo. It can be a still expo or minor cycle decks. Surely it's a cycle deck. 
RG. Mom shows that he's RG. It's not an easy match. So really play some supporting card behind this Mom. Phoenix. He can't block my void because I, the void is on the bridge. It's on the river actually. So he's in normal tower. That was too good Zap. Too good, too smart. So he start to argue from the behind. That's a really ideal start for me. Why? Because um, I can play the golem and the night bridge. I can defend with the bomber and the e -barbs. So my hand is open in this situation. So I play the night bridge. So he may play the monk because I have the um, support from the eagle bomber. Okay. So we're going to finding this Phoenix for playing the Void. What electric spirit he played. Millions of the bets are down. So smell of the RG on the bridge is coming. Actually the evil RG on the bridge. So I can put the Larmor Jig because he wanna activate his monk. Okay. What's his spell? So he can't now play another fireball. GG. Well, let me get your second tower, please. Oh, unfortunately, the last shot of the E-Barbs connected on a time up pins. No worry. That was a really good match. RG Monk Fireball in the um, five match without lose so we will go for mm, two matches to reach seven wins without losing this part of the video and then uh, we will continue for the next part so I have the Evo Zap definitely I will play Battle Prince what's his deck identify your opponent's deck if you're a lava player you're an expo player you should identify your opponent's deck Oh, my dagger's finished, but please kill this prince. If I back to the first half of the match, I will not play this golem. It's too annoying for me. Smell of losing is coming, guys. And he knows he played too well. Nice.
well played, so perfect match even. He's minded that he played from a right side really. Attack my Megalim here for the right side and I not surprising and uh, he played too well, but honestly we played too well too and oof, for six winning I don't have this expectation for mm, facing this such opponent. This level was uh, maybe on um, 20 wins, so it's my last match. I will play the Z. So I played 9, 30 Alex, 13 Alex, so I played E Barb's Void. So on Alexa management, I did better. 2 Alex here at least, I'm did better, so. No, no, guys, on Lancaster management, we are behind, we are equal. We are equal, I don't know how, but... Hard match. Oh, it was good. Let's see the positive things because now he can't play Lumber Balloon because his balloon, his Lumber is out of his use cycle. So he may parallel play the Prince on the bridge that he played. Okay, so he can now play another Golem. Yes, he may play the Balloon. It's Knight, maybe he play. Nice rocket cycle, rocket truck and play. Hit the tower, please. Hit the tower, please. <laughs> Unfortunately, I was unable to get the second tower, but it's okay. Seven wins, it was not easy, and mm, it was really good. So, guys, I'm waiting for you for the next part of this video. We are going to continue for from seven wins on the next part of the video. Thanks for watching until here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And those who need the my friend link, right? And also, things like the coaching with the price that I think two or three times is lower than the others, you can see this picture and DM or message me on the Discord. Farewell, until another great and magnificent.